Welcome in once again, guys. We're here to feed that Yu Gi Oh cardboard addiction, guys. You guys already know, guys. Guys, hold this thought for me. Just hold this thought. I'll, I'll be right back. Other than later, once again, guys. And lastly, you guys already know we always do the bonus, guys. The bonus, the 11th one is Mimiko Dungeon. Pick this spell card up. Look, you see the curvature on the chart. You had the V shape, you're tracing back down to the mean beautiful consolidation. And now we're going to fight the pivot high right here at 781s. And look, that's where we're at. Literally fighting that pivot high. If this pivot high breaks, it's a wrap. And that's what seems most likely with this card due to the curvature as we approach resistance here. Guys, we expect a break of the pivot high towards new all-time highs. Price discovery mode. That's what's expected for this card. Because again, a lot of people play, you know, picking up mini goals and at the same time, this is an ultra rare from the Infinite Forbidden, from the latest core set. You don't need to be worried about a reprint or none of that nonsense. Ban this hit. No, that's a good thing. You want to make investments like these this week. Now, you want to get exposure. That's the whole point of this mark. Why should keep this in mind? Because if you forget, you might come back one day, check the price of this card and see it at double digits and regret that you did not pick this card up this week, guys. So let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think about the structure of this mark. And watch just a couple of cards. Um, guys, guys. It's too easy, guys. Man, I wish I might get out of here. Get out of here. Guys, this was two, three days ago. Over 2.3K views. Your boy must be doing something right. Those people that stayed through the whole market watch got the bonus, the goodies at the end, guys. That's why you have to watch all the way through. Because, guys, guys, we were talking about this. What was the price? Go back. Go back, Jay was the price of this car let's see let's see seven dollars and 85 cents look at this volume look at it coming man man guys guys almost single digit listings guys when i look at the camera and i talk into the mic and your boy says it's too easy it's because it is man we got the crystal ball man we can see the future this was two to three days ago. Jay, that was you. You're controlling the prices, man. You you bought this card out, man. I wish, bro. Man, if I could buy a seven to eight dollar card out like that. Shit, your boy's eating good then. Hey, those would be good signs. Guys. Man, I, I don't know what else to do, boys. I, I don't, man. On I, I just can't. I, I just can't. Look, all time high in volume. All time high in volume. Literally told you guys. We told you. <laughs> we told you guys that the charts don't lie we told we talked about the pivots we talked about the chart we guys it's math mathematical equations visually represented on a chart some people call it graphs i call it charts these are charts guys guys it's all in the charts it's all in the math in the probabilities in the numbers in the fundamentals man it's not a, i'm pulling this out of my no 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 Guys, the evidence right there, the fresh off the flashback right here. Just two, three days ago, this video exploded. It was on a Saturday. I was surprised. I'm like, how? How? Your boy was at the GOAT Grand Prix chilling McMillan playing, you know, Yugi Boomer format. And I, I'm like, man, this thing is popping off. Ten cards to buy this week. <laughs> Guys, if you listen, you're already almost up to it. You, you can't make this stuff up, man. You cannot make this stuff up even if you try. I need a I need a move. I could talk so much about this and this card, guys. Guys, got all time high price discovery double digits. I just said that like two to three days ago, man. Look, you can't you just can't make this stuff. I don't know how else to say, it, man. Two, three days ago. We're not even talking about, you know, a month ago. No, it was like I told you guys to buy this card this week. And it's already up almost two X, man. Where else are you gonna get that? Where else are you going to get that prime information? It was all, it wasn't even me. It was the charts, guys. <laughs> man, I need to move on, man. Guys, Masters next. Masters next. Jay, but I miss Dungeon. Masters next. This is the next $5 Ultra Relic right here. You got a couple of one ups. Play set. This thing is going to be $5 before you know it. And it could be 750s to double digits. 51 listings only, guys. You're hearing it here first, here now. Guys, when they forget, we remember when they're not looking at these cards, we're picking these cards up on the cheap, on the low. Guys, the chart. What do you want to buy? The consolidation. Just look at it. You're starting to see the spike. No one, 
no one's paying attention to these who's talking about the one month time frame on tcg player in the yugi sphere in the yugi verse who who's showing this chart here right now this chart right here right now who is looking at this chart other than your boy and other than now you guys for this specific card no one that's why you're here we provide that prime value those prime investment opportunities when you can buy low and sell high guys and if you can respect that please destroy that like and subscribe button ring that bell guys we showed you the evidence this is what we do for a living i'm telling you guys we don't play with our food we do this on the daily guys almost at 5.6k i can't believe it you, you guys are destroying these videos look at that man look at that it's almost two k look at that man man uh, guys guys this is next master is next you come in you get this ultra rare you know what i mean before 750s to 10s to double digits don't be that guy this just came out fresh off the pack fresh off the press this ain't getting reprinted anytime soon you want to get exposure to this card don't let this be the next dungeon i've been telling you guys multiple multiple times this is the last shot for this card don't be that guy paying a premium sooner rather than later now we have arch nemesis protos it's not every card you know that is going up some of these cards are crashing down we told you guys around 40s dump this card is getting reprinted most likely i don't think a reprint has necessarily been announced but also banless fears again we talk about the double whammy banless fears plus reprint season has some of these cards getting destroyed right now 25 dollars after it was 45 bucks guys guys you would be up 15 bucks if you would have sold that 40s when we were first set telling you guys to sell this card hey but it's protos i need it and ritual beast is playing it and this card is great yeah but who cares when a reprint is coming and or a ban list you just never know sometimes konami unlocks a card then it puts it right back on the list you never know i wouldn't be playing that risk game this thing's gonna be in the teens sooner rather than later due to a ban list hit or a reprint so again again i wouldn't be holding these cards this is it's not the time to hodl it's not the time to hold on to these cards i'd be man recycling my purchasing power into cards like mimi goals i just told things that just came out core sets reprint sets that are recent guys it's easy the game is easy you just need to know how to play it right then we have here the bestial rubellion guys from the tins this card same deal either gets a slap on the wrist on the list um or it gets a reprint in the in the rarity collection three so i just wanted to show you guys i wanted to teach you guys something because it's all about the education that's what your boy does that's the value you guys get in these type of videos guys this card crashed down right nothing goes down or up in a straight line for too long why because then you have consolidation but learn this today 90 percent of the time that i talk about consolidation is before a spike you know buy this because it's consolidating and then it's going to go up keep in mind consolidation works both ways if you have consolidation after a downtrend move consolidation before that next leg down we always talk about legs up for the most part um you know what i mean <laughs> legs up yeah hey and then you know you also have legs down here like you know first leg down consolidation second leg down here guys status coming for this card it's consolidation literally literal consolidation before the next downfall that's just the way it is volumes coming in that's the way the markets work that's the way that the charts work so again this is this consolidation is the last time to sell for this is a five dollar card once it get reprinted or slapped in the written and on the ban list you know um pretty soon um so you just don't know another consolidation play this one used to be 50 bucks went down into the teens now spiking up into the 20s here a little bit recently but you're getting deals this is the last chance to sell sell them a great raging phoenix this consolidation you sell you sell consolidation phases after the the card is crashing down this is basically the market giving you a last chance before this is single digits and then five dollars and below um so here it is guys here it is man been talking about this card forever i mean hopefully you guys listen man if i'd had this man i wouldn't have it anymore because it would have been gone we have ritual beast tamer elder another one there's no way that this card it doesn't get reprinted soon i mean ritual beast just got lara and new support this card is still a single print is getting reprinted soon somewhere somehow guys so again still holding 14 15s if you're not playing look this card was 25 bones and now it's just 14 15 yeah it's down 10 dollars me if i'd have i'd move this man there's gonna be single digits and below once it gets a reprint um again could it spike up before sure anything is possible but these old cards you know with such a big reprint wave coming you just never know plus the deck actually got new support this is a great prime 
candidate reprint target right here so i wouldn't be holding on to this value i would be looking to recycle this right now right now guys we have evil hero dusted gold this card spiked up consolidating guys a little bit of a retracing back down to the mean but massive wave of volumes uh you know compared to uh, the previous volume here as we can see 15 bones this mean I, hey i mean this card could get reprinted though disclaimer becoming the rarity collection three this liquid soldier bane that would be cool you know but if it's to play i mean it, it depends man i get it i get it. if you're a hero player and you're buying at these levels this thing could spike up though before it gets a possible reprint i could see this in the 20s man this card used to be worth 80s 90s and hundos for the og print it was it was crazy so now that people know that evil hero is getting support after this consolidation i actually expect the second leg up so even as an investment around 15s not bad again short term plays not to hold on for months and years no no, no. short term you buy now a month or two down you reassess before the reprint wave um or whatnot so definitely a consideration um play a uh, trade right there uh, for that card we have red lotus king flame crime everyone forgot about this card this card used to be 15 beans man look at that now it's 654s man almost down 3x from all-time highs insane insane a lot of people talking about this card too i'm gonna touch base on it just here real quick um but again this this is consolidating here trying to hold that line trying to not go below five bucks um but again five dollars i'm a buyer five dollars i'm a buyer patience wins this game you know that's what we're waiting on because this card has a lot of you know applications to it it can fit in in many different decks you know it's niche but it has a great effect um and it, it has that potential you know what i mean so i like at five dollars i'm in until they until then i'm waiting on the sidelines um a lot of people took profits up, up here um so this card got destroyed but now this is what you want to buy the retracement a little bit of consolidation before you know a possible attempt at 750s and maybe even double digits again so when they forget we remember make sure you keep this one in mind shining star dragon a lot of people talking about this card i think this is a great penny stonk to buy right now this is the penny stonk of the day the penny stonk of the market watch buy this card hold on to it just get a play set i've heard the rumblings you know what i mean a lot of people talking about this card um you know the potential this is a dragon tuner and this that and the other i'd be i'm gonna be i'm gonna actually buy a couple of these around billy's because it's too cheap after that it quickly goes up 15 percent. so you know um clean if we clean this up janitor style it'll be close to under 100 listings this card just came out it won't get reprinted anytime soon you come in now you come in early you pick up the penny stonks early now don't be that guy sitting on the sidelines waiting too late paying two to three dollars two to three billies up two to three x down the line when that could be you buying now and you're up those you know um uh exponentials you know exponentially up two three five x you know what i mean hey hey right here right now this is the penny stop i bring up too much value jay how do you know these things because i was made for this this is my destiny <laughs> guys pick up this penny stonk right now that's what i would be doing but again this is none of this is official financial advice for entertainment purposes only you know who knows billy bob billy bob my guy only five of these left is crazy i don't know how there's still even five left you guys have been destroying you know um uh, these billy bobs man crazy and in person too you know everyone that comes up to me yo billy bob that that is insane so guys if you don't want to miss out don't forget you do get a 15 dollars off right here link in the description down below that you can use towards billy bob or anything else that you want and what not any deals any of the cards that we're talking about that we advise to buy you know not officially though as you guys already know um you know what i mean so you can take advantage of your 15 dollars off don't be don't be billy bob missing out on billy bob guys so make sure you guys take advantage of that discord it keeps booming i don't know what i'm gonna do with you guys if you have a discord by any chance link in the description down below come on get yourself in here man you know that thing is just wow what an environment we have in there don't miss out and the five minute read investment guide if you don't want to be like billy bob make sure you get that investment guide right here one click five minute read you got to work on your education man you got to stop being billy bob's out here you guys already know all right yo shout out to the first place winner at the regional that i went to in hollywood down there near miami south florida guys 200 players first place that is my guy who was rocking tenpai dragons you know we, we we yapped it up man dude took a picture that is my guy right there with the champ himself you know of the regional this this dude is just cool man just mellow uh, awesome personality look forward to meeting him again or seeing him again at the regionals that dude it, 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 can't wait man awesome awesome dude what what great energy man this community is the best on the planet best tcg community out there i'm a bit biased you know what i mean but it is what it is 
he was amazing here's the deck profile in the general tab over here if you want to check it out in our discord and look he even made a shout out to billy bob look at that look at that uh billy bob says no billy bob says no the alternate art bald billy bob let's go <laughs> you can't make this stuff up look at it hey billy bob already making it to deck profiles guys the best player of a regional repping it up with billy bob you can't make this stuff up man you cannot make <laughs> Look at the ball, Billy Bob token repping it up. <laughs> Look, people replacing replacing primal bean tokens with <laughs> alternate art Billy Bob. You can't make this stuff up, man. Shout out to I grind Yu Gi Oh. We we support fellow you know grinders out there. Um, hey, that's too little views, man. This thing, you know, if I refresh, probably has more. But guys, first place in Hollywood, over 200 players, and Billy Bob is repping it up. Uh, <laughs> You can't make this stuff up. I can't even talk, man. I can't even talk. My guy, Alvaro, guys, the Osama, member of the channel. I just needed a visual. I needed a picture. You know what I mean? I had a blast. I had a blast, man. He was kind enough to take me to the airport. This dude is an amazing human, man. Dude is awesome. If you see him at regionals, any of your locals, whatever, here around Florida, say hi, because he deserves that. Dude is awesome. Great trades. Played with me. You know, this dude, man, we had a blast, man. I got him this time, but I know he'll get me next time. You know, I was lucky because, you know, Brandon Fusion, if it pops up, you know, he, he would have had me good. Good guy. Hey, 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 that is my guy. I, that's what I love. Meeting members, man. Just having a good time. Um, And uh, yeah, yeah, you can't make that stuff up. So definitely wanted to shout him out again, but with the visual, guys. Um, Can't wait to meet a lot of you guys. Going to H-Town, Houston this week. And if you're from the area, let me know. Hit me up on a Discord, whatever. Let me know. And then, hello. <laughs> end of the month la jay show me the cards jay and i will but destroy that like and subscribe button guys right here ring that bell so you can stay informed stay tuned of our fresh off the press content guys guys what do we have here we have a couple of staples a couple of staples guys this thing is consolidating before that next leg up this card will be seven to seven fifties coming soon this is the last call these staples got reprinted they're not coming in rarity collection three they're not coming in the tins most likely so again these are the safer bets the safer plays with these tin, with these uh staples sorry so droplets i mean it's just such a broken card such a broken card guys and i need to see these oh, excuse me man apologize for that i rarely see these uh on the videos guys hey forbidden droplets guys right here right now 550s told you guys to pick these up at twos now you're paying a premium but this could be cheap compared to future prices these staples all of these staples are going to talk about they can all become double digit cards across the board because they're just that demanded guys so make sure you keep it in mind the card is broken alters attack negates effect quick play bro make sure you guys have your droplets you can never have enough of those pot of prosperity eh, i mean this one i just wanted to mention it that is waiting is waiting literally consolidating and waiting for the balance balance can come out any moment i don't know why it's not here right now or maybe at the time of recording should i check x see if it came out now nah, but guys again again this is waiting a lot of people this thing you know pot cards always get a slap in the wrist you know down to one whatever so a lot of people bandless fears you know on this card for sure so just keep that in mind in the back of your brain but again just watch it like a hawk massive walls of china look people think getting banned okay or, or i'm sorry hit on the list so you wait you wait just keep your eyes on it as a hawk because this super rare is going to be double digits ten dollars if it doesn't get hit on the balance triple t is another one triple tactics talent no one's talking about this card getting hit on the balance that was my fault i should have at least speculated put it a two on my balance take speculation video um because this card is too broken it has two effect i'm sorry three effects that at one point were just banned in Yu-Gi-Oh. like separate cards that had just one of these effects and this one has them all combined where you can choose you know pot of greed change of heart snatch steel back then they're now in the meta but they used to be banned for years and years and years and going for your opponent's hand is too good massive walls of china here at a hair under eights but again this could bump up to double digits quickly if it doesn't get hit on the list so keep these staples on your radar please infinite impermanence same, same deal look at that infinite impermanence just a clean super rare structure deck super rare look six dollars man six dollars pushing almost sevens I mean if we clean this up janitor style guys we can see here not even gonna put first stats but there it is you got sixes here six twenty threes then it quickly goes to sevens guys across the board i would not be surprised for infinite impermanence to be ten dollars um you know for all versions as you can see it says 666s so but the card was what 
Seven fifties pushing eights. Nines at one point? Bro, I'm telling y'all, this could be double digits, man. Don't sleep on it. It's getting harder and harder to get. People come back, they quit. They, they, you know, then they come back, they realize they're addicted to Yu-Gi-Oh! Then they need imprims again. They're going to come in and buy these up. So make sure that you keep these staples in mind. Look at Super Ash from the Rarity Collection. Just chilling right there. Massive wall of China at $5 post tax. Just get your ashes, man. I, I'm going to never get tired of speaking about and talking about staples um, because it's just too easy. Look at it. It's literally too easy to, to just own these staples. Everyone, just even as trade fodder. Everyone always wants staples, so you need to get them now just in case they bump up so that you can profit later. Just want to touch base on a couple of cards. Substitute. Everyone forgot about this card. Everyone forgot about this card, and now you can see if you go to the monthly, um, look, we just broke these pivot highs right here. So again, this is the sign. You go to the lower time frames. These are the small signs, the nuances that no one's paying attention to. You need to pay attention. You need to, you know, do your homework and see things like these. That, that means you come in and you get this card now. I have four of these. I won't lie. I would have liked to at least get an R09, but I am mad at a playset as well. Um, you know, and I'm going to keep it at that for now. After the reprint season, if this is still at single digits, I might come in and get at least two more to have an R06. Or maybe I could trade these, you know, towards these if I see them around there. But look, a lot of one-ofs. Then the walls are at almost 750s, guys. Eight pages only, 77 listings, guys. So again, again, you guys want to make sure that you get access to this card. There's crazy Edison hype, crazy Edison demand right now. You don't want to be that guy paying a premium for the max rarity holographic version of Substitute. Again, card is broken, man. Edison, man, the hype alone can push this to double digits easy and quickly. Don't be that guy paying a premium. Anima, Anima, wanted to show you guys was 832s the other day, dumping down the sevens. Why? Because people, I mean, it's just a couple of one-ofs though. But again, why people, you know, expect this card to get reprinted, expect this card to get reprinted or the best deck that actually uses, um, you know, this card might get hit as well. So those are things to keep in mind. This card needs a reprint, only has two princes, a max rarity secret. But again, um, it would be nice to see this get reprinted somewhere, somehow soon. And um, we'll see. Maybe even a quarter century would be nice in the tin. So we'll see. Me, I wouldn't be holding on to this card just in case because um, it still has value. People still want it. You sell into this you know last hurrah hype before the reprint wave comes same as wake up your elemental hero i will not get tired of talking over and over and over again about this card i just won't i won't because i can't believe look at that look at this volume insane hero players are crazy look at this volume man i mean compared to to lower levels that back here people volume is going up as the card comes down from 30 to 20s, just like I told you, we educated you today. This is consolidation before the next leg down, before the next fall in price, guys, to 15s and eventually single digits. So don't be that guy. Four pages only, 32 listings. Don't be that guy leaving this $20 bill on the table because you love hero cards. And then the card gets reprinted and everyone wants the new beautiful prismatic secret. Just a saying or whatever else comes, guys. If it gets reprinted, this goes down regardless. Don't hold on to this, man. I get it. Hero hype and things. But please, please, please. And lastly, just a random card. A beautiful card. Look at this blue eyes white dragon. Secret rare. This card is beautiful. The OG prismatics, man. Look beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. From the 25th anniversary Ultimate Kaiba set. You know, just wanted to show that the card is crashing down. Nah, man. These the, This chart, eh, it was too. Sales at 289s, 270s. You have just literally a one huh? right there but then it's three hundos and then gone guys then gone one page only five listings i mean it's people getting ready they're already gonna have their mahias so you know they're like you know what i'm gonna play three you know uh uh, uh kaiba set uh, prismatic secrets <laughs> oh man that's crazy but yeah i mean hey cards like these they look beautiful though like i won't lie imagine you're playing blue eyes once the new support structure that comes out and you're actually competing and then your blue eyes are these imagine that'd be crazy i mean there's a lot of great blue eyes out there this one's beautiful this one's beautiful i mean a lot of great cards came in here honestly man the tablet i like this one because you can't see the tablet or is that the the that's why that's the planet in the background she i mean i don't like quarter century uh that much i would prefer rarity wise the the prismatic secret but this one looks nice i won't lie it's like the tablet art but with the planet on the background they got this right man 250s quickly goes up to mahia prices to rent money prices 
you know, from Rent Money Mahia to Rent Money Blue Eyes coming soon to a theater near you guys if you had fun today guys make sure you destroy that like and subscribe button right there man i would appreciate it it really does help out if you made it this far into the video leave a comment down below yeah i can't answer every comment it's just too many um but at the same time and even for the members i need to catch up i'm slacking um but uh i i read most of them guys so make sure you leave a comment and uh you never know i might comment you hey 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 man guys guys say it with your boy thank you so much for your time for your support and for your attention stay fresh